What is going on, secret agents? Welcome back. But I'm happy we're back here with all the hoolies and with my good friend Wes from the team. What is going on, Wes? What up, guys? Super pumped to be back. Appreciate you having me back on here. I'm stoked to be here. But I want to give you guys just a little bit of a taste of what this looks like. So let's go check it out. I'm going to show you some a little bit of details about the Secret Agent Stash NFT livestream game. So here we are right now at uh, the Secret Agent Stash website, and this is a live stream game. So you can go here and I'll show you a little bit about what that looks like. But you can see here's some of the finished cards. So basically what happens here is these NFTs are, you know, used during the show. You burn them and then you get me to do whatever action or, or disguise is on those cards. So for instance, right here, you see Truth Serum. And if you play that card while we're live, I have to tell you one truthful fact about myself. Uh, maybe the blindfolded means I got to play uh, blindfolded for, you know, 20 seconds. Uh, but then we got we got to, you know, like our disguises here. So if you play one of these cards, uh, disguise cards, it'll get me to change into that disguise. Right? We have to be on, in a disguise every time we're on a, a top secret Thursday mission. But whatever disguise I am, I'll stop. We'll go and we'll change into one of these disguises that you guys get to play. So you get to interact and kind of, you know, direct a little bit of what's going on here on top, top secret Thursdays. And so then you can see here's kind of the, some of the parts you'd use to craft these things together. So when you get packs, you get these types of cards they are called build cards. And you have to find the ones that match together to craft them into the final cards that look like this. So like you see the sheriff's hat. So you need like the sheriff's hat and the sheriff's vest and so on and so on. And so each one of them has kind of their own little, uh, you know, uh, ingredients for crafting. And you can uh, then use that button and hit the play button here. So uh, that's a bit, that's essentially how it goes. But I think this should be fun. So if you guys do have some of these already today, uh, go ahead and, uh, you know, get them ready. So we're going to jump into the sky so we can play my pet hooligan. And that way no one's going to know it's me. <laughs> Share stash here, and we're gonna go into my pet hooligan today, and we're just gonna uh, smash on everybody, like left, right, whatever comes at us, we're coming at them. Let's go. Got with that sheriff. You get that sheriff disguise, man. I thought I thought I was on something with the Doctor Evil one. My next guess was gonna be Liza Minnelli. So, <laughs> all right. So what we're seeing here is we're as as uh, as Wes said, we're in early access right now, and you do have to have an NFT to get into the game, or or a, a hall pass. Yeah, there is. So generally speaking, right now, you know we all passed um, a selection of communities to let them in, but we do have a basic list as well. So generally speaking, somebody hits us up and says that they want to come in and check it out. We'll usually, you know, we'll like whitelist them and throw them in there. Very cool. And, and, and so, yeah, I love the fact that, uh, you know, there will be a layer of the game that is also going to be free to play, which Most I think is, is, is bullish. Yeah, for sure. And that's how it really should be. I think that I think a lot of games are starting to realize that now, which is great. Um, and so you can see that they like. So the funny thing is, if you look here in the left bottom, you guys can't see it. Wait, let me go this way. So you can see it like th those white dots there, those are people. They know that I'm here too. So they'll, they'll no, hover around and wait to try and kill you. <laughs> yeah, dude, they know you're in there right now. So. They know, they, I'm, I'm going to head to the pub. Screw all these guys. I'm not going to fight. The little beer on the map. I'm, I'm going to the pub, guys. Look at me. <laughs> oh, hi, yeah, that, that helps become a big hit in this game, actually. <laughs> Made it to the pub! Stash, you want to uh, roll a giveaway? So tell me about yeah, the pub here. Yeah. Can I get a drink? Most definitely. Okay, so right now you can't get a drink, but we do oh. have, we've got a whole bunch of stuff planned for this thing. Anyway, we've got a lot of ideas on how to pull out some of the social components and the social gameplay in these types of buildings and pubs like this. But, right. uh, but yeah, as of right now, no beer, but that is coming. <laughs> All right, let's burn some of these suckers down. Let's go. Now, I will say, like I said, the, the, the meta definitely seems to be around AOE kind of stuff because otherwise you got nothing. Everyone jumping around so much, it's hard to, like, get a solid, like... It's hard to get a solid shot on somebody. Yeah, I would agree Especially, we have new weapons coming in that change slightly, but as of right now, I think that that's pretty, pretty accurate. And also, I know that, I know still that, that grenade launcher, and, uh, yeah, I mean, before it was the paintball gun, but that grenade launcher is a freaking death machine. Yeah, yeah, I think I killed myself on that one. <laughs> <laughs> We've recently made a shift over to the Unreal Lyra system. 
which has fundamentally just set us up so much better. We can see, again, right now we've got Battle Royale and Team Deathmatch getting implemented at the moment. Just watching how smooth that is. Again, one just makes me immensely proud of our our team and just and frankly the, the amazing artists and devs that we have over here. And then also just uh, you know, it just makes me feel like more and more man, this is good. This is a good triple A game. This is I'm insanely proud. Um, so again, just big ups to the to the AMGI team making this thing. Mr. Stash, definitely jump on one of those skateboards and have Absolutely, man. Around. Give it a oh, shot. Yeah, I'll, I'll show you guys the skateboard. Yeah, yeah. Yep. All right, cool. I think our game team's getting Stash, they're coming to get you. They're coming to get you, buddy. Yeah. <laughs> you and everybody else on the server. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Sorry, I know it's kind of loud over uh, over here for me. Stash, have you found the have you found the uh, the shop? Pretty much. Yeah. Can you actually buy things in the shop? I didn't I didn't like necessarily look around as much, but so here, check this out. So if you go in this direction, yeah, let's get over here as well. We got a couple people over there too, so you're probably gonna have to battle. But... <laughs> <laughs> All right, cool. So there you go. Yeah. You could also maybe actually go into an actual mall and buy stuff too. So this is yeah. kind of the early work into that concept. If you go over, I think right now we've got these QR codes over there in the shoe section. So They're so the small. I was like, I, you said QR, and I'm like, man, I, I think it's going to be like a big right giant now, QR. But... It's kind of more of just an Easter egg than anything else. But if you go view, oh, this, okay. view those little QR codes. <laughs> So where does that QR code take you then? Yes, yeah, so that'll, that'll just take you to to our um, Shopify site, and then you can you know where you can just kind of buy my pet hooligan merch. Gotcha, but, gotcha. Uh, for actual. Yeah, so merch, it's yeah. kind of a funny little gimmick that we worked in there. But overall, you know, we are really, really excited for our in-game marketplace and just the the ability that characters are going to have to not only make their own digital assets and possibly sell those, but then as things that we'll be making the various cosmetics and things that you're going to be able to customize your avatar with someone's telling me this is how you turn down your game volume in your actual computer smash but what they don't realize is that i told as i said if i turn down the volume of the computer audio in general then you guys will not be able to hear our guests well either so, issues Looks like we got a uh, incoming transmission from headquarters, boys. Oh, mission recon. Looks like looks like you're gonna have to tell us your point of the point of the day according That's to true. this card. That's true. All right, mission recon. So when you talk about what my coin of the day is, uh, you know, and looking at where we're at, kind of in this in this bear market right now, and kind of trying to come back out of a out of a hole. Uh, I'm actually really bullish on sand, man. I think that, you know, right now, sand uh, around 80 cents is super undervalued. And with their everything they're doing in their metaverse, I think that token is going to be uh, a fire token to have here yes. when it, it, we start to come back into this bull cycle. That was a card from Stash's NFT game, guys. That's why that thing appeared on screen. Yep. That is interesting to be a part of it, compelling to play, and that, I feel like that's the most important. No, I mean, that's definitely the most important thing. I mean, I think if you can't do that, then nothing else really matters, really, in the end, you know? Economics or whatever, but. Looks like you're gonna have to pull off that sheriff hat stash. Oh, oh shit. We got, we got a disguise change card. All right, let's do it. We're gonna we're gonna come back. We're gonna hang out here for a second, and we're going for a disguise change because someone played an NFT card here live, getting me to change in disguise. We'll be right back. And we're back. Obi Stash Kenobi back Hello. in my pet hooligan. And we'll see if we can't use the force on some of these suckers to make sure that they do not come out in full force against old stash here while he's in a secret top secret mission. Come on, guys. Top secret mission here. I better see a lightsaber getting waved around. <laughs> I feel like there was a moment too in early, early development. We got it work. Just like, all right, hell yeah, this is gonna be fun. This is this game's gonna be cool. We've got a flamethrower. 
obviously it was in the, the Genesis collection as well. But when we actually got it, we were like, this is cool. This is going to be fun. How is that big game? Upcoming drop, man. I mean, there's a lot going. I mean, you guys, you guys have a ton going on, you know, and that's a, a good thing to see in a bear market like this, where, you know, there, there's some teams we just haven't heard from in a long time. <laughs> yeah, dude. But ultimately, it really, you know, like, it is just kind of like, you know, can you consistently just kind of put your head to the, you know, the nose to the grindstone and just and just make something cool? Can you make something valuable? It takes time and effort. Um, but for us, again. It's cool because we've sort of been in stealth mode lately, working on product, and now we've got a whole bunch of stuff coming out. What have we not tried out that might be... And some of these melee, oh, melee shit. tools too, <laughs> I gotta say, so... Yeah, let's see, what do you got right now? Um... Oh, it's mines. Alright, cool, you got mines. Oh, yeah. How long do they stay out? Funny enough, that's uh, Journey Crypto's board ape. We've got a good, good relationship with Journey, and uh, and we had uh, made some stuff with him and essentially his board ape. We, we were able to model and put in. So that's a, it's a little little Easter egg that's over there. You can kill him too. Come on, this guy is VR guy. Yep. Uh, so it's or, okay. So so the VR. So the VR guy is, um, <laughs> uh, funny enough, yeah, so you can, you can kill him, right? All right, cool. Got him. And then if you turn around uh, in the opposite direction. Yeah. Yeah, then there's that, that blue board ape. There he is. <laughs> Hell yeah. And again, burn him, so the burn him down. That's what he. That's what he deserves. <laughs> Dirty rotten apes. Yeah, so, uh, that's, what the, that's what the SEC is about to do. Yeah, yeah no, burn them all. <laughs> Well, hey, guys, I think that is mission complete for today, agents. We went into my pet hooligan and we crushed it. And uh, make sure you guys go check out my pet hooligan. Go jump on their Discord server. Follow them on Twitter. And uh, you know, maybe get yourself a hooli as well. And we can we can jam in there. And I can smash you guys too. Again, mint on the 27th, guys. Come join the go. carrot gang. Um, just so stoked. Appreciate you guys so much. Duck bot away, man. We're ready for it. All right. Let's go. All right, agents. That is mission complete. And all we have for today, secret agent stash.